Hi guys, my name is Marta. I'm currently 32 weeks pregnant with twin boys and I would like to show you what I packed in my hospital bag. <laughs> so let's start it from glamorous. Obviously, those are sanitary pads. All the possible kinds. This one I'm planning to put on the car seat when we are going to hospital in case my water breaks. The always ones are just adult pampers for incontinence. I think they will be helpful after delivery and just normal sanitary pads. This is mommy washer um, and uh, Earth Mama Angel Baby bottom spray plus uh, witch hazel extract. Another very helpful thing uh, is old panties. The older and the more destroyed the better, obviously. Um, breastfeeding t-shirts, bra, <laughs> very handy. And these are uh, compression socks. I heard that after delivery you might be very swollen, so these might be helpful as well for swollen feet. These are non-pressure socks for diabetics. In case my feet are swollen, there will be no sock marks. Pashmina in case I'm cold or to cover babies. Nightgowns, those are the biggest nightgowns I found online <laughs> uh, on Amazon. They are really humongous and I love them. Plus they have buttons to breastfeed. This is breastfeeding cover. Pretty self-explanatory too. <laughs> If we have guests, at least I will have something to cover myself with. Another nightgown. All of them are cotton and all of them are very nice to touch. So I hope I'll be able to use all of them. This is a robe. And another gown. <laughs> okay, so let's change position. <laughs> it's not so easy to sit on the floor when you're so huge. These are Ole um, wipes. for washing my face. They are dry, but when you wet them, they have like soap in them. Makeup, I don't think I will be using any of the makeup, but still, maybe for photo shooting. EOS, I, I can't live without EOS. <laughs> what else do we have there? Oral hygiene very important even when you're in pain this is this is just micellar water soap and face cream This is baby wash pumped into a nice squishy travel bottle and two tiny uh, hair conditioners plus non-scented baby wash and non-scented Dio. Nasal spray and water drops in case the hospital is very dry, which is usually the case self-explanatory <laughs> hair tools 
water spray it's just pure water in there but it makes me so refreshed and I think I will be needing it dry shampoo and perfume this is the thing <laughs> this is a um, hands-free bra for pumping um, because I'm, I'm going to have twins we might have to start pumping pretty early on so the hands-free bra might be very helpful yeah it's funny to wear yep here you are those are hot and cold packs from Avent to give some relief to sore nipples those are simple um, breast milk uh, storage bottles nipple cream nipple shields I hope we won't have to use them but in, in case we need to I will have my own ones in two sizes pads, booby pads <laughs> donuts to sit on after the delivery hair towel tiny towel to wet and put on my forehead to cool down and a normal towel mindful mom to be my favorite book I don't think I will have any time to read, but yeah, mint tea for refreshment. Squishy heart for stress management <laughs> during the labor. Fun. Yep, we are going to get hot in there. Chewing gum without aspartame, obviously. I have no idea what this is. Oh, those were those were uh, ear plugs, and this was sleeping mask, and this is just my lucky charm. The other things I will take last minute are phone charger, slippers, my computer, books um, and documents, a speaker, meds uh, taken daily, and other than that, I will take massage oil, snacks and drinks pillow and pillowcases, camera probably, pump and accessories, a uh, huge going home outfit, hair dryer, uh, change of money and essential oils. Yep, that's pretty all. Thank you for watching. See you next week. Bye!